back look hello and welcome to afternoon live i'm karen mack we've got a really fun show for you if you're still thinking about what to serve up for the big game this sunday our next guest has three delicious twists for wonton appetizers here to show us how to do it we welcome back to the show food blogger belki is with us belki it's good to see you Hey guys, very nice to see you too. How are you doing, Kara? I love how you always take one ingredient or one dish, you know, the, the, the wontons, and make it into different things that you can enjoy. I love it, the variety. Yes, yes, it's fun. And you, you, you know, you don't think about wontons necessarily at a cup, right? We're used to seeing it like, you know, as a wonton soup or something, you know, that way. But I like to do things a little differently. So I thought, why not make three different appetizers with the base of a baked wonton you know especially because it'll be a little bit healthier right no frying this time Kara <laughs> no frying <laughs> so it'll be a lot easier so I'm going to start off I'm making three different ones I'm making a black bean one for those vegetarians out there that don't want any kind of meat then I'm going to move on to a taco one and then a lasagna one so it sounds good right it sounds great you've got a lot to do though so I'll let you get started so the black <laughs> bean is first yeah, we're going to start with that. And you just take a muffin pan and you're going to grease it up. And then here you have the wonton wrappers, right? So you're going to take one wrapper and you're going to lay it in there just like that. And you're going to make sure it's touching the base, right? So that it gets that oil in there. And then you're going to take a second one and think of like the shape of, of a flower, like a bud. You want the edges to kind of be separated. So that way when they get nice and brown, they look kind of like a flower. And you'll see it in a second. So once you have the entire muffin pan filled, then you're gonna go ahead and spray it again. You're gonna put it in the oven at 375 for about eight minutes or until they get golden. But you have to remember that a lot of ovens are not the same and some cook it much faster, some much slower. So you don't wanna burn them. When you're done, you're gonna have these babies. Look how cute, just look at this. Oh, I How pretty. love them. Oh my goodness, like little taco right? salads almost. I'm getting yeah, excited. it's almost like a tortilla, you know? Mm -hmm. it's, it's just so fun and so cute. So I'm gonna move on fast because I know we don't have a ton of time, but I'm going to be using, everything's gonna be fast, right? So we're gonna take a can of corn, we're gonna rinse and drain, right? Black beans, rinse and drain. We're gonna take, in this instance, some hot salsa. Three tablespoons or so of that. We're gonna mix everything together. I already have it ready for you here, right? So this is our veggie. And then we're gonna take some guacamole and we're gonna make it the base of this beauty right here. And then we're gonna take this and we're going to just go ahead and top it off. And that's all she wrote for this one. What do you think? Oh, I love it. Such a great idea. That is like it's a little so mini taco salad for vegetarians. Yes, mm. exactly. I love it. So then we're gonna move on. And we're gonna go ahead and make the actual taco one. And it's gonna start off with beef, right? And then let's do some guacamole. And the fun with this is you, you can play with it. You can do whatever you want with it. You can add, take away. Then this is the actual pico de gallo. And it's going right on top here. And then I'm gonna take some taco cheese and I'm just gonna dump it right on top. And another cutie pie. That is so, I was like, please don't forget the guacamole. This is a good activity though. <laughs> Everyone can almost just make their own if you have all the ingredients mm -hmm. out. Exactly, you can set it up as a buffet. And then of course, I think, again, I always think about the kids. The kids probably would love to do some of this stuff with you, right? Oh, absolutely. Especially assemble it, yeah. We're moving on and this is gonna be the lasagna one. So this is gonna be fun. I took some ricotta and an egg, I mixed it well together and that's gonna be the base for this one. Right here, mm -hmm. then I'm gonna go ahead and add my beef. Now this beef, I actually seasoned a little bit Latin style, so the recipe for all this will be on the website. We're gonna go ahead and add some tomato sauce and I'm gonna go with something just traditional so you know we already have seasoning in the beef and then some mozzarella, oops got a little stuff and then these babies you're gonna throw it back in the oven for like five minutes or so just so that the cheese gets melted and then the ricotta heats up too at the bottom and then you have a lasagna bite I love it <laughs> so you know when you heat it back up you don't have to have it in the cupcake tin though no you don't you can just put it straight on you know a, a pan whatever it doesn't matter because it's already in shape so you don't need to do anything other than that so it's fun, right? So easy. Now with those wontons, can you actually do those ahead of time? 
and stick them in the fridge. You can. And, okay. Yes, you can. And that's what's great. Because of the shape that they are, they can even get that. Oh, look at that. You see? Super yes. simple. So it's wonderful. Yeah, it's, it's wonderful idea to do with these. And also, you can make actually all of these ahead of time if you wanted to and put them in a platter because all the ingredients are cold. Oh, so, and even the beef, even though it's a little bit cold, you're not putting like an enormous amount of beef. So that should work out well too. Someday we will have these big yes. parties again, Belky, and we'll have to be for making all of them for now. Thank you yes. so much. Yes, have fun during the big game, you guys. You yeah. too, you too, good to see you. I want more